Hello there and welcome back. In this video <laughs> we are going to take a look at how you can work with C types in Python and how you can uh, utilize the GCC module to compile code. So basically we are going to create a folder which is called C typing. This is basically a Fedora system, Fedora 32, with the default installation. You should have the GCC and the CC commands available to you. Let's enter the C typing. And here, what we would like to do is to create the sum.c. And here, let's create the our function. So this is going to be called our function and we give it a num numbers argument, so how many numbers we have, and a pointer which points to the numbers. And what we would like to do is to create the i variable, we would like to create a sum which is going to be zero, and we would like to iterate over every value from i equals to zero until i is less than the number of numbers and increase it one by one. Now we would like to add the numbers i index to the summary and simply return the sum value. And now, if everything goes well, what we should be able to do is to issue the cc dash fpic shared dash o lib sum dot so from the sum dot c. And what did I mistype? So num number the <coughs> and if everything goes well we have the lip sum that as so now we need to create a test.py function import the c types and then we can use create the underscore sum variable which comes from the c types dot cdll dot forward slash lib sum dot so and the sum our function dot arg types is equal to c types dot c underscore int and c types dot pointer which is pointing to the c types dot c int and we need to create the our function signature from the numbers with the numbers argument and the global sum is going to be basically a global variable which is the underscore sum and we will have the num numbers which will be the length of the numbers and we will have the array type which will be the c types dot c underscore int times num numbers and we will have the result which is equal to underscore sum dot our function and we will have this function signature copy and paste with the exception that this is going to be the array type and c type so int is going to take the num numbers and we would like to return the integer of the numbers rather the result <coughs> Let's uh, rename this to test uh, sum.py and in our test.py 
what we can do is to import the sum and print sum that our function one two three four five and if everything goes well we should receive the 15 on the output <coughs> So what do we have here? Vi sum dot py and this is not right. Integer is required. So now we have an error in the sum dot py. So our function, let's just get the sum.c, our function int numbers, int star numbers, that should be fine. And here we have some problems. So this should be c types underscore int, c types pointer, c types c int, and we have the array type, which will be star numbers. <coughs> 3.8 test.py. And now this is working. So what we did is to create the sum.c, where we had our function defined. And we also created the sum.py, which basically created our function signature. And inside the test.py, we were able to call it and utilize it. So technically, that was all I wanted to show you. If you like this video, you know what to do. See you in the next one.